Hello and welcome to Newton Stories. Today I'm going to be reading Super Tato. Some vegetables are frozen for a very good reason. Don't believe me? Then keep reading. It was night time in the supermarket and all was quiet. But, crash, bang! Something had escaped from the freezer. Something small and round and green. Something looking for trouble. Big trouble. Help! Help! cried Carrot. I'm stuck to the conveyor belt. Ah! Oh, cried Broccoli. Someone's drawn on my face. Hmm! cried Cucumber. Who was doing this? And was there anyone who could help these vegetables in distress? Super Potato to the rescue! He used his super speed. He used his super strength. He used a flannel and some soapy water. I know who's behind this, said Super Tato. There's a pea on the loose. <gasps> oh no, not a pea, everyone gasped. Yes, a pea, but I'm out of the freezer now and I'm never going back. <laughs> and the evil pea ran off to commit more terrible crimes. Time for a dip, little veggies. That's enough, shouted Super Tato. He leapt towards the pea, but the pea popped out of his hands and vanished in the thin air. Super Tato set on a super search. He crept through the cakes, checked the cheese, and snuck up on the beans. Then something caught his eye. The game's up, yelled Super Tato. Kapow! But the pea bounced out of reach and onto a super trolley. Super Tato was just about to stop him with his super strength when the trolley crashed and he was thrown down into the icy depths of the freezer. Was this the end for Super Potato? <gasps> Not quite. But the pea was off his trolley and lying in wait. You're finished, Super Potato, he shrieked. But Super Potato summoned up all his strength and ran for it. The pea nearly had him at the beans and closed in on him at the cheese. He had him cornered at the cakes. So much for Super Tato, screeched the pea. You're about to be mashed, Potato! Surely this was the end for Super Tato. Not today, my friend, said Super Tato. Gotcha! <gasps> said the pea. Watch. Oh yes, said Super Tato. I set my trap and you fell for it. Or should that be in it? And he grinned a super grin. Super Potato had saved the day. Take him away, he said. And the pea was marched back to the freezer where he belonged. This jelly tastes of pea, said Broccoli. And everybody laughed and cheered. So remember folks, some vegetables are frozen for a very good reason. Maybe you'd better go back and check your freezer, just in case there's an escape pea in your house. The end. Thank you.